the energy vibration there's in for the Scorpio energy okay um welcome um this is the week of the eighth so it's in um and uh, um a lucky week for a lot of people okay so um the energy is in this week is the energy of the sun and the zodiac energy is water so this is a good week for you guys um good emotions are coming up the sun with water is positive it's as if the seas are calm and everything is okay so this is going to be a good week for you guys so um the week begins from the 19th until the 25th so this is a positive energy so let's see what is happening i want to say thank you to all the newcomers and thank you for my old um subscriber and thank you so much for supporting my channel Monday what do we have and I have to put my glasses on because the eye princess oh my god this is the first time the eye princess comes up this is the first time the eye princess comes up so um, the eye princess is here for you guys on Monday whatever is happening your spirit guides are protecting you on Tuesday you have the energy of the world you so beautiful you scorpion you have the energy of the world my babies oh and Wednesday you have the two of ones a new beginning a new start this is going to be good oh my gosh oh my gosh and then you have the Empress listen you scorpions <clears throat> no one has gotten the eye princess and no one has gotten the world and the empress so this is going to be a good good week for you pisces oh my gosh this is just going to be wonderful this is just going to be very very wonderful then we have the energy of the magician another major arcana so for you scorpions a lot of major arcanas are coming up in this week and then you have the ace of wands a victory and a success and a new begin and this is a new beginning energy of the world and the two of ones new opportunity new um, possibilities are coming out for you so you Pisces new work this is going to be good and the king of cups this is yourself this is going to be wonderful oh my gosh congratulations you Pisces and you have to deal with the energy of the queen of ones whoever this energy of this queen of ones is you have to deal with the energy of the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Whoever the Queen of Wands is, is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Okay. So, um, let's look. And it is the weirdest thing with these cards because, as you see the sign, you would think is the sign of the Pentacles, but it's weird because it comes up also. For um, the energy of um, um, the sword, so this is kind of weird. Whatever is going on, this is kind of weird. But yes, okay. So you will be having some situation with the Queen of Wands. Who is the Queen of Wands? This is the energy of the Aries, um, <clears throat> Leo, or Sagittarius. So you're going to have a situation with uh, the Queen of Wands. So Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. So let, let's look and see whatever is going on. On Monday it's going to be a good day because your intuition is going to be I and your spirit guides are going to be here to protect you and guide you so whatever is happening whatever is transpiring um, the energy of the eye princess and your spirit guides are here to protect you the energy of the world comes up in with a week of the Sun this is wonderful this is positive this is going to be good because the energy of the eye princess is a uh, coming up and this is bringing wonderful good a possibility and new energies that are coming in the energy of the two of ones is here a lot of new opportunities and um, the world is opening up and a lot of new business opportunities or um, if you're looking for work a lot of that is going to be coming up because with the energy of the two of ones um, it is standing office offers are going to be coming in to you a lot of office offers will be coming in to you and this is going to be good okay the energy of the Empress obviously there's a lot of office with um, work 
um, there are new people new situation a new office that is going to about to come in and is going you know this these offers are going to be very very good so if you're looking for work you um, Pisces not to worry because this is going to help um, happen for you a lot of new offers are going to be coming in and then we have the energy of the magician that is going to help you. So the eye princess and the magician is going to help you. This is going to be positive and wonderful because on Friday, um, um, a lot of new situations and a lot of new um, doors are going to be opened up. It says this, the world is open up for you and you weren't seeing this before and now you're seeing this and now you're understanding what is happening for you. And this is going to be um, a very, very positive then you have the ace of wands a new beginning so some of you are going to be starting out on a new journey a new job a new relationships and it's all about business for you guys in this week it's about you changing your life and you transforming yourself in such a way and this is all about uh, um, new beginnings in work because the energy of the ace of wands with the two of wands is always new opportunities are coming for you new um, uh, um, office are coming for you so if you were looking for work and you were looking for business partner this is going to be happening so for you men um, this is going to be um, a positive time because a lot of new offers if you were looking for work or looking for business offer or looking for a new form of study or a new career this is going to be happening and you are going to be received in high favor okay so this is going to be um, a very good you're gonna be received in high favor oh my gosh this is such a clear cut reading okay what I'm you know this is just the strangest um, form of cards because it is um, the Lord of the Ring cards and <laughs> um, so okay the energy of the star the star of David is always um, positive things coming towards you and if you realize you're reading the two of ones and the ace of ones these two cards in a reading is saying that if you were looking for new opportunities new possibilities new house new whatever you are looking for new doors of opportunities to open new places to go if you're looking for a good vacation if you wanted to travel the world this is going to happen for you because what is transpiring here is that the ace of the ace of ones a new beginning is going to be happening and this new beginning is right this new beginning is going to open up the world and the world by opening up that the, the, the new possibilities a new beginning you're opening up the world and what is transpiring is that the energy of the two of ones has uh, happened for you so this is going to be wonderful and this is going to be good so whatever the situation is or whatever that was transpiring you need to know and you need to understand how very important this is going to be this is going to be a fabulous week for you guys and whoever this queen of ones is not to worry because she's helping you to actually open up doors of opportunities for you whoever this queen of one is it's as if your spirit guides are bringing this queen of ones and she is going to help you open up new doors and situation the magician is here and the magician is going to help you to connect to your inner wisdom and guidance and listen more um, to that and by doing that you're going to open up new possibilities and a new situation in your life two of ones is um, you know just opportunities good luck um, good situation coming in your life and that is going to bring you a lot of financial abundance in your life you are going to be victorious and successful if you have a situation that you're dealing with the queen of wands you're going to be extremely victorious and successful with this situation so if you are dealing with the queen of one you're going to be um, uh, successful but it's gonna it's, it's gonna um, um, it's going to turn you in the uh, uh, enemies are going to be made so let's say um, you were dealing with a situation with a queen of wands um, you're going to be victorious and successful over it but you're going to make some enemies but who the, who cares seriously you know what is better you know you and uh, you know but you will be protected so the ace of swords is an, an, an a card of victory it's a card of 
um, overcoming a situation and what this is doing is that this is showing you how positive it is because you have overwin a situation even though you have the energy of the moon and um, for you scorpion you have nothing to worry about because you are, are aware of um, your you are really aware of your you know enemies and you're showing up your enemies and you you know starting out on a good part in um you know this is going to be a much more positive some of you are going to be looking inwards to find the truth of a situation and trying to connect with yourself and trying to understand things and realize that uh, you know you have everything that you need to make it in this world and you are going to be victorious and successful oh my god thank you so this is the center of your readings you scorpions and um, you know I love you guys so much you victory and success is going to be coming in for you guys victory and success is going to be coming in for you guys because this is your week you know you're going to be victorious and successful over your enemies whatever that has transpired whatever that has happened new at the face of once this is this is good because at the end of the week you're going to receive um, at the end of the week you're going to receive um, a new offer and, and uh, yeah a new offer and this new offer is going to um, bring you a lot of money a new offer and this is going to bring you a lot of money um some of you are going to have new love coming in your life which is wonderful and positive a lot of love comes up in this week and um, I was expecting that last week um, for um, the um, energy of um, the uh, Valentine's but there wasn't so much love as in the week of the Sun so this is this is good and this is why I do the energy vibration reading because there is so many stuff that comes up that people need to know and understand how things work and how energy works and um, last week I don't think there was so much love and now new love is coming in new love is coming in whatever the situation is that is it's as if the universe is going to um, orchestrate a meeting of you and someone um, if you had a relationship with someone who was an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra um, you believe in this person behind um, it's as if you're moving forward and um, the movement that you're you're about to make is going to protect you it's a positive movement of protection there is an end to a burden that you have carry and this burden was people um, um, you know uh, you were under pressure with uh, people you were so under pressure with people and this burden that you have been carrying now you have ended this burden once and for all there is a sense of victory and success that comes out so this is going to be a wonderful news positive news is going to be coming in in this week so this judgment is bringing um, wonderful positive news so um, victory and success new beginnings new start a lot of new beginnings um, new beginning is going to be happening for you guys because the energy of the world is going to open up and um, these new beginnings is as they, as you know things the blockages the energies move away from you new beginnings new possibilities new offers is going to come in so um, work is going to be powerful whoever is looking for work in this week is just going to be positive you're going to be victorious over everything whatever obstacles whatever situation that you have been going through you are going to be extremely victorious over the situation new beginnings are coming up new um, a new start is coming up with uh, um, you and the, uh, um, you men you men are going to have a fabulous start this new offer that you're about to receive is going to bring a lot of financial abundancy and the protection your um, 
financial protection okay a financial security and a victorious because this is the center of your reading and this is the center of your week these energies are telling you what to look out for and what to know that is about to happen and this is the center this is what everyone the feelings of victory the feelings of movement the feelings of new work the feelings of new possibilities the feelings of new opening coming up in your life and this is going to be good so congrats you scorpions I love you guys so much um, let's see what are the messages or here relationships new relationships are going to be happening for a lot of people new things relationships are going to be better um, you are going to be leaving some people behind and that's okay energy of the moon comes up and you guys work with the energy of the moon so work with the energy of the moon use this energy of the moon because mm -hmm. this is your intuition and guiding angels that are orchestrating certain things for you and certain aspect for you and this is going to be working out in your favor this is going to be working out in your favor and this is very very important to know exactly what is happening okay um for we finish the reading you have the energy of hurt element so this is good this is wonderful this is positive because the earth elements are going to be helping you guys in this week and it says I gratefully accept the abundancy the hurt bestowed upon me I gratefully accept the abundancy the hurt has bestowed upon me I gratefully um, except the abundancy the hurt has been bestowed up on me and this is going to be good this is wonderful this is positive it is going to be a fabulous 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 week for you guys so namaste until next time yeah.